Hello, welcome to lick number 33. I'm going to keep playing off of uh, the, uh, the, uh, the little rhythmic pattern, uh, chord pattern I used in lick number 32. So for today, lick number 33 is this. One, two, three, four, one. <laughs> Lick. Let me play the pattern with it. I'll show you what it'll sound like. So that's the lick and that's the pattern. Uh, the way we're going to do the lick is this. Um, a lot of this is, is very good for uh, learning syncopation of down and up picking. Um, so we keep in, I'm keeping the right hand moving a lot of times with the one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So in this case, the eighth notes I'm playing um, uh, are are denoting the, the down up. So one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and pattern. It's a little bit of a, a swing feel to it. So instead of one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and strict like that, it's kind of a, of a lazy uh, triplet or swing feel like one, a two, a three, a four, a one and two, a three, a four. Uh, uh, we use that kind of feel a, a lot in um, for a lot, a lot of different kind of uh, rock and blues playing. Okay, so this lick, uh, we're in B minor pentatonic, form one. Uh, uh, basically, it's a four-note pattern using the middle two strings, uh, strings uh, uh, three and four. So we're starting on string four on the ninth fret with the third finger. I'm in seventh position, so first finger is taking the seventh fret. So third finger on the ninth fret of the fourth string on an up pick, then a down pick on the third string, seventh fret, up pick again on the seventh fret of the uh, fourth string with the third finger. Now, a little bit of a collapse over to get the next note, because I'm going to play the seventh fret now with the same finger, the third finger of the third string. So that's going to be a down pick, and then kind of rolling back to the uh, fourth string again, seventh fret. A third finger. Now first finger on the seventh fret with a down pick. And then downs at the end. Down on the seventh fret of the fourth string. Down on the, uh, I'm sorry, this one just before that was ninth fret of the fourth string. Then down pick on the seventh fret of the fourth string. And then down again on the uh, ninth fret of the fourth string. A little bit of vibrato. Uh, every now and then here. So here's the look again. One, two, three, four, and one. Up, down, up, down, up, down, 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 down. And again, notice I have the, the picking pattern kind of moving through the whole thing. A lot of ghosting going on. There's a ghost up. Some ghosting. There's some ghosting in there too. So... Uh, so I'm maintaining this down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, even when I'm not playing notes. So one, two, and three. One, and two, and three, and four, and one. Um, on, on that one, on the second time you hit the seventh fret of the third string, we can string. We can do a little bit of a like a quarter uh, tone bend, little bluesy thing. Oops, right there. Vibrato on that one. We do a little bend here if we want on the seventh fret to kind of lead into the seventh fret bending a little bit. Just again about a quarter step bend to kind of lead to that ninth fret. Last note in the, the lick, and we could do a little slide on that. So one more time. 
I believe I'm coming in on the and of one, so one and two and three and four and one. <laughs> a lot of notes with something like this but there's some cool technique things as far as down and up picking and you know we have a little bend in there a little vibrato so there's some definitely some techniques uh, that are being used here so I'll play with the, the pattern one more time So that's lick number 33, and again, we're using the chord pattern that I set up in um, uh, uh, lick number 32, uh, but this is lick 33. Okay, that's it.